It's a rainy day and I'm in my kitchen and I'm making mustard. So I thought I'd bring you with me. Let's set you down. Not on top of the bottle that we need to get into. Here we go. Hi. So we got a jar here. This holds probably about two cups. Do you have a bigger jar? Look, this jar is fine, get over it. And then in here, I have three quarters of a cup of brown mustard seeds with some yellow ones because I didn't have enough brown and I had this small baggie of yellow and I think they're mustard seeds, it wasn't labeled. And then uh, a measuring cup. The recipe I have calls for all vinegar, which I know will make a spicier mustard. So I need a cup of this, but I'm gonna use some wine also, hold on. Ooh, I want the smell of vinegar. Take that off. So I think instead of using a full cup of this, I'm gonna use like, I don't know, two thirds or something. We're gonna use as much as we feel like and not more. Yep, that's a good amount. I have a bit of like FOMO with this because what if it would have been like a million times better if I had used all vinegar. Oh well, that's what. Right? And then we're gonna put, mm, my hands smell like vinegar. So we're gonna put wine in there. White wine. This is gonna be like, you know, Dijon. So I got a good white wine because I'm gonna have to drink the rest of it. I don't have an option. It's local, obviously. And we pour the wine. This is a cup of liquid into our seeds. I always think like they look like some disturbing sort of bug thing at this point. I'm going to give it a little stir to make sure the, you know, it gets throughout. And, um, that's it. Now this sits for a day or two, and then we'll add some spices and put it in a blender. But, uh, that's the mustard for now. Hope this was helpful.